Hi folks, Caroline here. I just wanted to record a video um, right now while I'm still buzzing, um, talking about purpose and understanding your purpose statement and how that, it's, it's not about what you do, it's about who you are, as JJ always says. Um, so my purpose statement, and I got this through the brand incubator process that I did last year, um, is to carefully listen with love for others to feel validated and alive in their own perfect beauty so that they feel completeness in knowing their true self is shining through. And now that's the statement that was given to me a year ago through a process of uncovering my purpose in life. And I've been using that as a kind of, it's been in the back of my head now for years. I've been trying to figure out what I do with it and how I can create a business around that and how I can, you know, show up in the world um, to live a life of purpose. Now the word purpose gets banded around a lot and a lot of people have a lot of different interpretations as to, to what that means. Um, to, you know, to live with purpose, to live a life following your purpose. You know, what's your purpose in life? Why are you here? All this kind of stuff. And um, I just wanted to share that this has been going through the back of my mind because you might have seen some of my earlier videos I was talking about potentially starting a coaching business. And one of the reasons why I thought coaching would be good for me is because coaching fits in very nicely with carefully listening with love for others to feel validated and alive in their own perfect beauty. But I took that statement very literally and was thinking about, well, my coaching therefore has got to be about people feeling validated and alive, people, f you know, about beauty, about their own perfect beauty, because that's been a thing for me, self-image, you know, loving myself, self-love, all that kind of stuff. So I kind of thought that I had to, or I was going to create some sort of coaching program around beauty, self-love, blah, blah, blah. But it's kind of like the pennies dropping with me um, recently. Uh, just like, you know, little bits each day as I get further, closer and closer to really understanding how to pull everything together. Um, and how that our purpose, and the, as JJ says, their purpose is not what you do, it's who you are. Now, I've pivoted recently. I've decided that that, that form of coaching business around self-love, self-belief, self-image, didn't sit quite right with me, not yet. I'm not ready to teach around that stuff or to coach around that kind of stuff. And I don't want to be known as a, as a coach necessarily. I don't want to be a full-time coach because in my mind, there's a belief that that's still a trading time for money type thing, that you're paid by the hour, or paid for your time to, to be on calls with people and to coach them, or you're, you, know, you have a coaching program and it's, you know, I don't know, something about it just didn't sit quite right with me. So I've kind of taken a bit of a tangent recently um, because I can see a problem in our online business community that people are struggling with and that I have the skills to solve, to help them solve. And that's more technical stuff. So nothing to do with, you know, the airy fairy, fluffy, self-belief, self-love type coaching stuff. This is around YouTube marketing and around, you know, creating campaigns um, to advertise, in, in our case, um, uh, SFM affiliate businesses. But the skills, you know, I'm also working as one of my um, sources of income with a digital marketing agency doing YouTube campaigns for e-commerce. So, but, you know, so the point being advertising marketing through YouTube. So there's this, this problem out there that I'm seeing that a lot of people are struggling with that I can help with. And that's setting up their UTM tracking, for example, setting up Google Tag Manager, Google Analytics, Google AdWords, YouTube channels, linking them all together so that they all work together understanding remarketing audiences, understanding sales conversion goals, all this kind of stuff, which to most people probably goes, Woof, means absolutely nothing to them. To me, I understand all that stuff. I can see it make sense. And so I, I have the skills to set these things up to help other people. Now, the whole point of creating a business is to, you know, you create, don't create a business to make money. You create a business to solve people's problems. Um, and that's how you provide value, you know, and people will give you money in exchange for solving their problem. That's what business is fundamentally about. Um, so back to the purpose thing. Now I, so through this kind of going down this route now of helping people with their YouTube campaigns, I've got, a, I'm building up a selection of clients and one of my clients I'm actually, so I've got sort of different levels of, of I suppose, service. I'm still trying to work out what this, this, this thing looks like and what levels of service, and what products and uh, I offer. Um, but um, my, my <laughs> if you like, my high ticket at the moment, um, offering is helping is actually running 
somebody's YouTube campaigns for them. So they're going to create all the creative stuff, the ads, the landing pages, the thank you pages. They're going to manage the funnel, the emails, all that kind of stuff. And I just do the YouTube bit. Um, now, as part of the discussions we've been having about, you know, OK, let's get our ad together. Let's get our landing page together. And um, we had a call this morning um, so that we're getting ready to launch our first campaign. And the call turned into an avatar and messaging call. So who is it that we're trying to speak to with these campaigns? Who is it we're trying to help? Um, and what problems are we solving for them? And we ended up having a two hour call, but more or less, drilling in to this person's avatar and their messaging. And I could see their energy levels rising as we drilled into really who they really want to help and what problems they want to solve. You know, really talking about where they've come in their life, what where they were at a year ago before they found the SFM, what they were looking for, what they were dreaming about and how they didn't believe it was possible for somebody like them. Fast forward a year, look at how they've completely transformed their life um, and understanding how that transformation has happened and how they can communicate that to somebody else so that somebody else can go through the same transformation. And just seeing his energy levels go, you know, just rise. My energy levels were rising as well. I was buzzing. And, you know, he said to me at the end, Caroline, I've never been so clear on who it is I'm trying to help and how I want to help them on my messaging. And I just, I just want to go out and write great ads. That's what I'm going to feel right now, you know, because this is it. This is who I am. This is what I want to do. And to me, that was brilliant because I was living through my purpose. I was carefully listening to everything he had to say. I was asking questions to clarify and to, to drill down onto the certain points of what he was saying to get more specific. So he was talking more specifically to what to a certain type of person, to his avatar, um, than to, you know, you know, I just want freedom in my life. We all want freedom. You know, what do you want to do with that freedom? How do you want to use it? So we drilled into these things and he got so crystal clear that he was just like, this is this, Caroline, I've never felt so energized about helping these people and really believing that I can help these people. Now I know who they are and, and how I can help them. And I was buzzing because I was living through my purpose. I was helping him to feel validated in who he is, you know, who he was, who he is and how far he's come. And alive, I mean, he was literally buzzing uh, in his own perfect beauty for being the beautiful man that he is beautiful person that he is and the journey that he's been on over the last year the transformation he's been on and trying to hold the mirror up to him to show him how successful he is and that actually you know what he values how much of that he's already achieved you know through his own great determination and hard work um so that he felt complete in knowing that you know his true self is shining through and that it just shows to me that there are so many different ways that we can live our purpose, you know, that our purpose can, can come out and can, can different ways that that purpose, because your purpose is, like I say, it's not what you do. It's not YouTube campaigns. It's not a certain coaching program. It's not, you know, what do I do when I wake up in the morning every day? What's my job? I don't, you know, it's who you are. It's, this is how I show up to people. Um, and then if you apply, if you combine your your purpose, so this is this is the kind of jigsaw puzzle I've been putting together. Your purpose, which is who you are, with your passion, which is what you enjoy, and for me, that's helping people um, progress in their life and business, but particularly online business. I, I love technology. I love technology as an enabler, and I love helping people get into this world where they really work with technology and they don't they're not scared of technology, um, and that they can actually use it to to great advantage to really help themselves and their families and community and society and the world you know be a better place um so that's my my passion and my my skills are with the technical stuff but also you know with with making the technical stuff accessible and available and helping people to use it to their advantage and not get stuck with it and not let it hold them back from achieving their dreams and so that's my purpose my passion and my skills all aligned along with my values and my values are you know uh, uh, aligned with the people I'm kind of working with in this online business community because we all go through a kind of like a value filter to get into this community so I'm helping people that are aligned with my values you know this person's values are um are also about helping people but about traveling about the beauty of the world about creating creating videos you know filming photography all those kind of things you know so it just when it all fits together it works and that to me is fulfillment. That to me is 
living with purpose, with passion. That's what life is all about. And so I don't know if that makes any sense to you at all, folks, but um, to me, that's just like so many little pennies have dropped. When you see it all come together and when you, it works and when you understand why it works, you can see it's because all these different things are in place. And that's what we're aiming for, folks. So don't get focused on the how or the what, you know, what you have to do, what kind of business you want to create, how are you going to do it, you know, who you need to be. It's, it's who are you? What skills have you got? What are your passions? And how can you bring them together? And there's no one right answer because I think I can combine though that my, my purpose, my passions and my skills in lots of different ways. And all of them would make me feel good and make me feel fulfilled. And it might be that at the moment it's YouTube campaigns, but maybe six months, a year down the line, it might be something else. And so there's no one size fits all and there's no one solution that's going to last you the rest of your life. Because although I think, I believe your purpose doesn't really change, how you bring that purpose and what combination of passions and skills you combine that with, you know, can, can change and can vary over time. And that's what keeps life exciting. Because if we were doing the same thing for the rest of our lives, how boring would that be? Okay, folks, I've waffled on for long enough, but um, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you while I'm feeling this energy and while it's all just kind of like making sense to me. And I hope that that kind of makes sense to you and gives you some kind of hope or excitement about, about how you can find your purpose and combine it with your skills, skills that you've currently got, skills that you're learning and with your passions to give you that fulfillment in your life too. All right. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in another video. Take care. Lots of love. Bye bye.